I'll call Shinsi. The real reflection of you. Just got out of martial arts class, driving home. Made a quick little pit stop because that's what you do sometimes. <laughs> ah, <laughs> during martial arts, got kicked in the stomach and lost my breath, you know? Uh, like, what is it? Uh, lost my breath. I think that's the proper term. Oh, I got the ning. I got the winds knocked out of me. Not a fun feeling. Um, and yet at the same time, it is what it is. <sighs> Today, past couple of days, I haven't really done too much as it relates to, uh, to like making video stuff. Um, a little bit of acting stuff, a little bit of modeling. Uh, actually, that's untrue. I did some acting and modeling this past weekend, Friday. Um, and that was a really busy day. Um, I'm just taking the steps, you know, taking the necessary steps that are necessary. And, I don't know, making contacts, um, doing the actual work of uh, making the videos, make, taking pictures, finding photographers, finding videographers, doing everything, you know, the whole nine yards around it. Um, there I found that's, like, super, super important, again, just to, like, be aware of and to be... Uh, to be doing you know to be making the steps at the same time part of it's just like let it gotta let go you know it's uh if it happens it happens if it doesn't it doesn't i just know that i'm doing the work and that's all i can do um a mix of the two i found is really really important um because a lot of it is like kind of just luck of the draw you know um and yet at the same time a lot of it is you got to really be hitting the pavement and these are all just things for me and these are things that i'm finding for myself um, man, a lot of, like, I'm finding, like, like I mentioned, Friday was, like, super packed. I had uh, the photo shoot, and then immediately after I had the video shoot, it was both in New Brunswick, and then immediately after that, I had martial arts class. And so, bam, 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 it was, like, <laughs> it was a lot, you know, there was a lot going on. Um, super easy to get frustrated. Didn't really eat too much that day as well, and so, um... Just a lot of, like, whatever, moving around and schedule here, schedule there. Uh, I got to be here. I got to be there. How am I going to, like, just thinking of all those things all at the same time. And then just like, bam, I got to go to the next thing. All right, now it's the next thing. And so <clears throat> kept me on my toes. Um, also made me realize and just appreciate how much, like, that the opposite, right? I think it was Saturday was pretty much just a day of, like, all right, nothing. You know, like, kind of just... You can sleep in a little bit today, like just a complete opposite, you know? Um, and I appreciate that polarity, that, that sense of like, today I've got this and I've, it's fully packed and then the next day, like nothing, you know? Um, that can span over longer periods of time, right? Like there's periods, the past month, if I really look at it, I was just looking at my uh, little, little resume thing that I put together and I was like, wow, I did like, I think it might've been six, maybe seven shoots in the month of November. Um, every month has been kind of increasing and it's cool. You know, I mean, on one hand, I'm like, oh, well, I did all that work, but I don't have the final product out yet. And I'm like, well, where is it going to be? It's like, mm, no need to, uh, no need to worry about that all too much. You know, it'll be there. Uh, just keep doing the work, you know? So all things that I'm thinking about, things that I'm doing, I'm learning to let go a little bit more of all of the, uh, of, of that. I kind of mentioned that, right? It's just like, I'm doing the work, got to let go. Um, that's the tough part sometimes is like, um, that letting go of whatever happens, happens, you know? What else is going on? Um, finding ways to like continue to recreate myself. You know, I remember... I was looking back, I don't know, just Facebook put stuff up, right? And there I was, like, looking back at seeing some photos and posts and stuff over the past few years, um, remembering what I was like even just a few years ago, like, the things that I was posting, the people that I was hanging out with, and so on and so forth. A lot more social, or maybe, I don't even know if I was necessarily more social, but I was just out on nightlife a lot more. These days, not so much, you know? Um, so I had a little bit more disposable income back then. I say a little bit more because 
it's just a little bit more. It, it doesn't really make a difference. Um, and so I'm just finding ways, like, how do I recreate myself? Like, what can I do to re- not even rebrand myself, but to just continue to, like, make more of myself, you know? Um, and there, it's like, I'm finding more and more. It's, I mean, yeah, outfits are cool and whatnot. And miraculously, I don't know how, I somehow always find a way to, like, pull off uh, a new, completely new outfit. Um, maybe, yeah, or borrow some elements of things that I had before and, and so on and so forth. But I just find different combinations, different ways of putting these things together. Maybe the accessories are slightly different. Maybe uh, the shoes are different. Maybe, I don't know, something, right? It, it just the longer hair now or whatever right um there's always something that i'm finding that like constantly recreates the outfit from the same places that i have like or the same pieces that i've had and that's something i really man i i admire that about myself i really do candidly not in a way of like oh check me out more in a way of like well done you know so it is what it is what it is keep up thrive stay sexy